Hello and welcome in this video for this exercise given during the uh, Olympiad of Mathematics in Finland in 2015. So this exercise is this one. You want to find the real values that are verifying square root of 1 plus square root of 1 plus x equals to cubic root of x. So if you want to give a try, please pause the video. Otherwise, let's see the solution. When you've got such an equation to solve, a way to solve that is to set a new variable. Let's call a equals to cubic root of x. Then, x equals to a cube. So now you plug this in the original equation and you obtain square root of 1 plus square root of 1 plus a cube equals to a. You want to make this square root disappear so you raised both sides to the second power and at the end you got 1 plus square root of 1 plus a cube equals to a squared. You want to make this square root disappear, but before that you need to put this one on the other side of the equation and you got square root of 1 plus a cube equals to a squared minus 1. You repeat the same process, you raised to the second power, and you will get at the end 1 plus a cubed equals to a squared minus 1 squared. If you look at the right side of the equation, between parentheses, you've got a squared minus another squared. This is a remarkable identity a squared minus b squared equals to a minus b times a plus b. On the other side of the equation, you've got 1 plus a cube and another remarkable identity which is nice to know. This is 1 plus a cube equals to 1 plus a times a squared minus a plus 1. So you will get 1 plus a times a squared minus a plus 1 equals to a plus 1 times a minus 1 squared. So you can notice that you've got the same quantity on this both sides of the equation. So you can simplify if and only if this quantity 1 plus a is different from 0. So case number 1, let's see when a plus 1 equals to 0. You've got a equals to negative 1 and a also equals to cubic root of x. So x equals to negative 1. If a plus 1 is different from 0, that means you can simplify and you get a squared minus a plus 1 equals to a plus 1 times a minus 1 squared. So first step is to expand this square. So you get a squared minus a plus 1 equals to a plus 1 times a squared minus 2a plus 1. Then next step is to multiply these two quantities and you got a squared minus a plus 1 equals to a cube 
minus a squared minus a plus 1. So you can notice you've got the same terms on both sides of the equation, so you can simplify. Minus a and 1. So at the end you got a cubed minus 2a squared equals to 0. Then you can factor by a squared. This is a squared times a minus 2 equals to 0. So this time two cases. Case number 1, a equals to 0. And a equals to cubic root of x. That means x equals to 0. Second case, a minus 2 equals to 0. That means that a equals to 2 and equals to cubic root of x at the same time. That means x equals to 8. So, so far we've got three numbers, negative 1, 0, and 8. And because we did a lot of operation, we need to double check. So, we are going to plug these values into this equation to see if it's valid. So, first case, x equals to 0. So, you plug 0 on these two terms. Cubic root of 0, this is 0, and square root of 1 plus square root of 1 plus 0, this is square root of 1 plus 1, this is square root of 2. And because 0 is different from square root of 2, x equals to 0 is not a valid solution. Let's see case number 2. Case number 2, x equals to 8. Cubic root of 8 equals to 2. And if you plug 8, you will get square root of 1 plus square root of 1 plus 8. 1 plus 8, this is 9. Square root of 9, this is 3. 3 plus 1, this is 4. Square root of 4, this is 2. So, 8 is a valid solution. Last case, x equals to negative 1, cubic root of neg negative 1, this is negative 1, and if you plug negative 1 below the root, you will get square root of 1 plus 1 plus minus 1, this is 0, square root of 1 plus 0, this is square root of 1, this is 1, and because negative 1 is different from 1, so you can disregard negative 1 as a solution. So the only value is x equals to 8. Thanks for watching this video, and I hope to see you in another video.